hey guys what's going on welcome back to my youtube channel and in today's video we are doing a major zara try on haul for early fall 2022 and i wanted to just jump right into the video so i'm gonna start off with this beautiful green suit that caught my eye literally the second i walked into the store so i got the top in a size small and the pants in a size small and i feel like the top fit really well and i really love how like it has like that deep v plunge because i feel like it gives you that like super sexy effect and you don't really have to wear anything under if you don't want to maybe you could try it with a little bralette if you are not trying to expose too much of yourself the pants were a little bit too small in the thigh area on me but they were a little bit too big in the waist area i love the simplicity of the suit i feel like you can definitely dress it up and wear heels and a nice bag with it or you can dress it down with like sneakers and a nice bum bag to complete the look so the next couple of things that i got honestly make the perfect outfit i love this jacket that i picked up i picked it up in a size medium just because they were sold out of a size small i honestly don't mind a size up because i know i'll be wearing like sweaters and sweatshirts under it so it might honestly come in handy if it's a little bit bigger i also got this pair of jeans that i think are super cute i got them in a size up and i thought that they're going to fit me just right however they are a little bit on the bigger side but i don't mind it and i also ended up picking up this crop top the crop top i will tell you is super cute but it is is a little bit too big on me i feel like it keeps sliding down my torso and i constantly have to keep adjusting it so that's the only like down part of it but i do think it's really cute i feel like if your chest is a little bit larger than mine i feel like you should definitely have no issues wearing this crop top i always tend to have issues wearing crop tops like this they always just tend to like slide down like they'll stay up but if i'm not constantly fixing it and adjusting it like there's a chance that my nipple might pop out and i definitely do not want that i really love the simplicity of this outfit i feel like this is very in right now i think it's perfect for late summer early fall honestly when i put the jacket on i really got like a super influencer vibe from this like this is definitely someone that i would see walking down the street in new york city i totally picture myself wearing like big sunglasses and like a nice bag to be completely honest with you guys i feel like sometimes the outfit is made by the accessories like i'll put on something super basic sometimes like even this like this is not anything like extra extraordinary but when i styled it with some of the pieces i recently picked up i was like oh my god like this looks so good and that is another video that i will be dropping so if you haven't subscribed to my channel and you want to please do so you don't miss that video because i will be styling every single outfit that i'm showing you right here with a couple of luxury items that i ended up getting so this next outfit that i will be showing you guys i thought i was getting something completely different than what i actually got i knew that i was definitely getting this sweetheart top but the pants i really thought that the pants were high-waisted turns out that they are low-waisted because i feel like now everything is going back to like the 90s early 2000s trend where we are wearing everything like low rise which i am not against that i really really like that kind of style so i was pleasantly surprised but the outfit that i had in mind was more sophisticated and i feel like this outfit is a little bit more like street style wear or you can turn it into like a street style like what goes in my mind when i see this outfit i think of a really awesome oversized vintage denim jacket maybe that has like those diamond studs on it some graffiti very nice sneakers and like a little bag and i feel like this would literally be super cute but yes my initial thought was high-waisted black pants this really nice crop top and like a pair of black heels and a nice bag to go with it for like a girl's night out versace 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 tell me this does not scream Versace vibes to you I picked up this thing and I was like this is literally I have to have this there's a story behind it when I was in Miami I went to the Versace outlet and there was this really amazing outfit that looked just like this however it was in light pink and the print was slightly different it was very beachy so it had like starfish and seashells the outfit was definitely not corny the pants were $500 the top was $500 and the little camisole that went with it was like $3.99 or $400. So the whole outfit was about 
$1,400. I am not a rich, you know, spoiled housewife or a sugar baby. Therefore, I could not afford it. So I was on the lookout to find something very similar to that. And Zara had it. They delivered. It was a different color. But I'm not mad about it because I really do love this color too. I feel like the pink would have been more of like a statement piece, which kind of explains why Versace would make it. It's definitely a lot more Miami. I feel like this might be a little bit more New York, which is fitting because that's where I am right now. So do any one of you guys ever feel like some things are just acceptable to wear in like one city and not acceptable to wear in another? Because I feel like that literally all the time. So the next outfit is a little bit more basic. It's just a tweed skirt with this super cute sweater top. I feel like this outfit is perfect for an early fall or a late summer day. It's something that I would wear for like a night out with the girls and wear like thigh high boots I think would go really cute with this. You can dress it down with a sneaker. I feel like even if you wear a nice heel and a nice bag, this could work. The skirt is a little bit too short on me and that seems to be a trend with me and Zara skirts. I don't know why I keep going back and thinking that miraculously they're just gonna get longer, but it is a very cute option for maybe a girl that is a little shorter than me, like five, eight and a half and below. So this last outfit is for all my girls that wanna look super cute, but be comfortable while doing it. So I really like this little jean, I don't know what it is. Is it a shirt or is it like a light denim jacket? It's like a crossover in between kind of situation. I'm not mad about it. I'm really not because it is super soft and it is very comfortable on my skin. The top is not from Zara. I ended up getting this from shopsider.com and the leggings are from Zara. They're super comfortable and I really love the way that they fit my body and they are long enough because sometimes when I get leggings, it's really annoying because I'll get like a camel toe and the leggings will be way too short. They'll be like halfway up my calf just because I'm super tall. But this kind of outfit is definitely something that I would wear to like run errands, go meet my girlfriend for a coffee. I would definitely add like a cute little bag. I would add a pair of sneakers and like a baseball cap and you are good to go. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I have a lot more videos coming for you. I did a whole series of them. So make sure you stay tuned, subscribe, hit the post notification bell button on so you never miss a video from me and I will see you again next time.